today on Be Something Wonderful, the missing link between your desire and its fulfillment. I am your host, Tom Karen, and this is the Be Something Wonderful studio of higher consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Creators, welcome back. Good morning. Big video today. This comes from a few sessions yesterday, and two notable ones that I wanted to talk about was one of them said, Tom, just like you said in your book, I get it now. And then the other said, Tom, I feel like I've found the missing link. In both these cases, their 3D, their life, their world is changing around them fast. And what is it then? What is this missing link between your desire, between your assumption and its fulfillment? And I've talked about this in other videos on the channel, probably about uh, several months ago, but it's faith. But we're not talking about blind faith or believing. It. We're talking about faith with knowing, right? But what is it faith in? It's faith in your I am, right? Because why? Because when you're standing in that I am, faith is built in. It comes with it. There's nothing you have to do. You don't have to do, try. You don't have to effort your way to believing. It's already there. So I really want to hit this because that is the missing link. I want to start here. I've, I've done a, video, a few videos on the metaphysics of Muhammad Ali's life. And, and you can find those on the channel, but I, I want to refer to those today because it directly relates to what's happening with these clients, right? That, that they're finally getting it, that, it, that you know, after, after the struggle, after the trying, after the doing, they're resting in the assumption of their I am. They're resting in the faith of our I am that's already built in. They know, they know now, Tom, I don't have to struggle to believe. I don't have to do anything to make myself believe. I am. Right? So I am the greatest. I said that even before I knew I was. Wow. Listen to this wording. I figured if I said it enough, I would convince the world that I was really the greatest. Hear, the, hear what Muhammad Ali is saying here, right? I, I said it before I even knew I was. In other words, even before that realization, when he says, when he says I am, he's referring to this idea that before Abraham, was, I am. Before Abraham, I am. I am always exists. So be, even before you realize it or come to that realization, it's already there. Even before I knew I was, I figured if I said it enough, I would convince the world that I was really the greatest. Hear the wording here, convince the world. In other words, who are you convincing? You are the world. So it's self-persuasion, right? Because, because as, you, as you stand in that faith of that I am, right? That, because faith is built in. That becomes your world and it reflects that, your assumptions, right? That's what everyone is you pushed out. They are just reflecting your assumptions. That's what that means. That whole world reflected that assumption. Even before I knew I was, look at that. Before Abraham was, I am. Do you see it? I am the greatest, <laughs> right? Before Abraham, before time, before everything, there's just I am, right? The don't, and then he goes on to say, don't tell me I can't do something. Don't tell me it's impossible. Don't tell me I'm not the greatest. I'm the double greatest. Here's our Lee doubling down on it, doubling down on his I amness, as, as even as the 3D world may show him something different. He doubles down. He says to that, he says to 3D world conditions, Right, people have been to say, don't tell me that, 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 don't tell me it's impossible. Don't tell me I'm not the greatest. I'm the double greatest. He doubles down, doubles down on the faith in his I am. No matter what the 3D world and conditions were showing him, no matter what the appearances were sh showing him, right? It's the truth of you, right? It's that faith in your beingness. Let's unpack this like we never have before. So what is the link? The link is faith. Faith in what? I am. Right, your desire, your assumption, and its fulfillment is here. That's what these clients are realizing. That they're letting go of all of that holding on and trying to do things, trying to make things happen, trying to, quote, manifest things into 3D. And just standing in the realization, it's already theirs, right? The fulfillment's there. They're the link. 
right? You are the missing link between your desire and its fulfillment, between your assumption and its manifestation in the 3D world. And that is your I amness. And that faith is built in. You exist and will always exist. When you say I am, you have full faith in I am. You know you are I am, right? You know who you are. You know that. That's full faith, right? That's powerful. There's no doing or effort required, right? You can't be more or less than I am. I've talked to this now over several videos, right? Your I am equals that faith. It equals what um, Neville Goddard calls loyalty to the unseen reality. That's what loyalty to the unseen reality is. It's your I am. Life's not a struggle, but a surrender. Our prayers are answered by the powers we invoke, not by those we exert. This is what both of those clients got, right? It's not that you invoke that power by I am, by standing in that I am. I am the greatest. I am the double greatest. Muhammad Ali invoking that I am, right? Doubling down when the conditions are showing him something different and saying to those conditions, those 3D conditions, those 3D circumstances, don't tell me it's impossible. Don't tell me I'm not the greatest, right? That you're invoking that I am. That's powerful. Faith is seeing and perceiving the greater reality behind appearances. That's the link, right? Remember, between your desire and its fulfillment is seeing the greater reality behind the appearances. The greater I am, the greater reality behind the appearances links you directly to its fulfillment. Wow. <laughs> That's powerful. Faith is a greater knowing. Right? Do not judge according to appearances, but judge with righteous judgment. That's what Jesus was saying there. He wasn't saying get rid of 3D circumstances, d d reject them, run away from them. He was saying just don't judge them. Judge with righteous judgment. In other words, judge with the faith in seeing and perceiving the greater reality behind it. Judge through that I am, that faith in who you are, that greater knowing. Behind every appearance, right, and, and, and within every appearance, is the totality of all probable realities and infinite possibilities. I love that word. I, I think it's Louise Hayes that used that. The totality of all possible realities and infinite possibilities. Behind that puny, tiny, 0.0001% of reality, of seen reality, and within it, not just behind it, but within it, is all of infinity, is everything you want. Right, remember, the reality or infinity is a hologram. So in every part contains the whole. Within it and behind it is everything. It's the totality of all infinite realities, right? So, so there it is, that, that 0.0001% of infinity, you're at the center of it. And all of it is within it. All of this is within that. I am that. That's that dot, I am that, that's what you're saying. But really you are this, you are I am, right? I am the greatest, the greatest within the great infinity, right? And then doubling down when, when you know that it's just less than 1% that it's showing you, you double down on it, you know that you are I am, right? We often are deprived by, of our high goal by our effort to possess it, Neville got it. It's all that effort. To be more, you can't be more or less than I am. And everything becomes effort when you try. <laughs> when you struggle, right? I am. Faith and fulfillment are built in. That's really what I want to say here. That it's built in. The faith is built in. The fulfillment is built in. It's already there, right? Your only work is to choose what you desire and assume it and claim it. That's your only work. And, and, and that's not work. You're just going to be I am. <laughs> that's powerful. The missing manifesting link between your desire and its fulfillment. I am your host, Tom Karen, and this is the Be Something Wonderful studio of higher consciousness, where we help you level up and become the best version of yourself. Creators, thank you. Thank you for being a part of the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for liking and sharing the videos. Thank you for commenting. They're, they're just, I'm thrilled with your, your comments. I love them. And um, uh, you can visit our Facebook group at the, 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 we're called the Be Something Wonderful Ambassadors at facebook.com slash groups slash Be Something Wonderful. We also have an Instagram and Twitter account at Tom Karen, 
or just go to our website anytime at tomcaron.com or be something wonderful.com. Guys, more coming, more videos, more live streams. I will schedule the next one. That's going to be coming from Vietnam. So stay tuned. I'm still, I'm still working on it. Um, guys, with great love, with great light and infinite gratitude, this is Tom. See you soon.